Good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the Crew Motor Fest. And today we're dipping our toes in a little bit of soy sauce and ramen noodles, if you will. We got the Toyota Supra A80 from the year 2000. Yeah, that's right. You heard me. Absolutely correct. Never have I ever customized this car in a racing game. Like ever. Even in 2015 where it existed, I don't think I ever made a video where I did something like that. So, yeah, this, yeah. Like, I don't even know what else I have to say. It's, it's this car. Like, it's, this is the it car for JDM fanboys. I mean, this and the Skyline, which I've done at least three times by now. Obviously, as one does. I... Let's take a look at the power before we get started. We're looking at a 700 horsepower, 3,300 pound, 3.8 seconds, 0 to 60 JDM machine. Is that average? Yes. Is that actually slow for the tier? Extremely yes. This is in street tier 2, and we're rocking a 3.8 second acceleration. Do you know how slow that is? I'm going to do a comparison. Okay, for some reason the, this okay, it's the same one, that's why. <laughs> the new Supra, 3.2, okay? Taycan, 2.6, 4.1, it's shit. 3.4, still quicker. 3.1, 3.4, 3, .1. 3, .4. 3. Are you see where I'm getting at? Yeah, yeah. This is one of the slowest. And that's kind of disappointing because it's the Supra. It's like, what? That's crazy. You know, it's... If you get it, you get it. If you don't, you don't. There's no two ways about it. Now, car-wise, color-wise, I'm sorry. I'm not sure, but I think we know which livery we want. I think we, we know which one we hope we find. Yeah, it's this one. Why the fuck? This might be it. This could be it if we change the color. I think it's like more of a metallic orange, right? Yes, it is. Is it? I don't know. I think we're gonna go with this. This looks pretty good. Now hopefully we can customize it to the, to the best of my mental knowledge and ability. To what it actually looks like in real life. I, I know that one was correct. That we might need to pull up a reference image. Hold on. This has to be lore accurate, okay? I mean it doesn't look the worst, I suppose. We can't even do anything else. What is why is Toyota so stingy? Okay, that was annoying. Rumble and tumble, I guess. We're gonna, let's see how it sounds. I don't know how it's gonna sound. Sounds pretty realistic. Holy shit. Like the fact that Toyota on this car no less doesn't allow you to put nitrous color. Like, are you looking at the same car, Toyota? Come on. These chrome rims, I mean, they did turn out okay. Wish they had a much better rim selection, I'll be honest. The front end looks great. I think it looks really cool. It's not as perfect as we could have wanted or hoped, but... The back end is... Everything else except the wing and the front. It's about as good as we're gonna get. I'm a fan of this. Damn. I think I know exactly which event we need to try it out for, too. I know exactly which one. Finally, here we are. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love this event. And this car mixed with this event is a perfect combo because it's nothing but JDM. Like, largely. 
Whoa, what the hell was that? Whoa! We took that jump really bad, and it may have just, it cocked us. But we're gonna make it back. We've, we've got time. We can do it. I do you wanna see how this thing handles? I would say it turns just enough, which is good. It's not the grippiest thing ever. I also have uh, got the no nitrous modifier on from a previous race with the challenge that I did. Oh, it, that's okay. There's a brother. We got a brother. We, well, what the heck? We just dropped top speed on the gear shift. That? That's actually a bit unacceptable. That's kind of crazy, to be honest. I think one thing I've realized is this car, it's, it, like, it's not that it's, it's not that it has no grip, but it's kind of like that it has no grip. So basically it has no grip. It's fun because, like, a street car that you can drift around turns, that's what I would want. Right? I mean, who wouldn't? So maybe it's not the best for actual drifting, but more like having fun with it in the free roam. You know, stuff like that. So, yeah, it's interesting. And across the line. Oh, look at our baby. Oh, she looked pretty. Oh, she looked pretty. Ladies and gentlemen, I mean, that, that's going to pretty much wrap up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys on the next Crew Motorfest video where we'll be covering another new vehicle, presumably. Until next time, guys. Peace.